Maiden First Nations Goannas captain Adrian Davis has called on selectors to secure their seats for tomorrow night's battle against Newcastle, guaranteeing there will be plenty of talent on show when his proud and passionate squad run out onto Hunter Stadium. The Kempsey-born 23-year-old, who used to play for the Knights after moving to Newcastle at the age of 12, now plays in the Queensland Cup. When given the chance following the Goannas captain's run on Friday, the humble halfback earmarked fullback Javan White and forward Reggie Saunders as two to look out for. Reggie wants to make a statement in tomorrow night's game and Javon's just elusive. He's on his feet and that. You know, so if he gets some space out there, he's just going to carve it. Meantime, across town, Davis's cousin and fellow first-time captain Tyrone Roberts led his side through their final training run before the big game. The Western Suburbs junior is itching to lead his team out onto their beloved home turf. Here for nearly eight years now, so you know I consider myself as a local, and you know to be able to go out, run out the boys, and captain the Newcastle side, it's going to be a great honour for me personally, and I'm sure everyone get along, and enjoy the great game of football on the weekend. Knights coach Wayne Bennett has chosen a mix of experience and youth in his side that will take on Laurie Daly's Goannas. Veteran Clint Newton will run out in Knights colours for the first time since 2007, while three brothers will feature together for the first time on the big stage. There's some that there's brothers, Sione, Mariutai, Chanel and Pat, some young brothers that are coming through the, the ranks as well. And you know, we've got a couple of mixtures, like he's mixed it up, so it'll make it a bit competitive. It's going to be a great game. Oh, there's, there's a lot of talent out there, so you know, keep your eye out for everyone. First Nations Goanna's squads will go head-to-head -head at 7pm on Saturday night, marking the culmination of a week-long cultural festival being held this year in place of All Stars. These fellas um, know how to play the game, they've got skill, so hopefully we can gel on the night and then show it on the field. But one thing that, that these fellas has got is heart, and I think that's going to show tomorrow night. Amy Lindsell, NRL.com.